Lemon. Okay, let me explain. So, a while back, my friend Lemon sent me an invite to his Minecraft server, the Lemon SMP. So I joined with the same goal any sane person who has touched grass before would have. I'm gonna become the emperor of this place. My axe just broke. So, how do you become the emperor of the average Minecraft server? Well, there's three steps. Step number one is pretty simple. Find a spot for your empire to reside. Step number two. You need to get as much of the server as possible to join your empire. Step number three. Remove all of the threats off of the face of the planet, sending them into a large universal trash can where they may stand till the end of the time. Before I do any of this though, I need to get myself some gear. Luckily, the server has a villager training hall, so all I needed to do was chop down some trees, which I had already begun. After not very long of mining wood though, I noticed that another player, Anton Alex, was online. Okay, so I just noticed Anton Alex, he's mining for iron, and that's just what I need. So, I'm gonna call him. Hello? Yo! So, um, I, I heard that you're mining for iron, right? Yeah. So I just joined the server, and I'm pretty new. I have, like, nothing. So I wanted to try and bring up a, a deal with you. Mm-hmm. Do you want some diamonds? I have hot, I have a stack of diamonds. Ooh. Yeah. I would love that. My side of the deal, you can get a quarter of my empire. Amazing. Anyhow. Oh my gosh, seriously? Oh. I found a new land. Okay, boom. This guy's so cheap. Alright, okay, I'm just gonna get myself more stone. Gonna get myself a couple stone axes. I'm gonna just grind out some, some gear. Someone has joined it. Soon, after a few hours of mining and exploiting capitalism, I was able to get a full set of gear. SHINY! I'm gonna show the owner of the server my empire. Let's see what he thinks. If we can get the owner of the server on my side, then I'm gonna have a really big advantage. Thou shalt wear this as a crown of honor. I'm looking super powerful right now. Now I may have a set of gear. But so did everyone else. To become as powerful as possible, I would need something different. This is where my plan came in. See, the owner of the server added a data pack where when you kill the ender dragon, it drops an elytra. This led me and my teammate Anton Alex to get some blaze rods and gas tears so we can craft all the end crystals to respawn the dragon. I'm trying to get some blaze rods so that we can go to the end. What's annoying is that they mind all the spawners. I have to wait for those blazers to naturally spawn now. Getting the blaze rods was going too slow, so I headed back to my base so I could trade for the remaining two. Hello. Take this. Bup. Amazing. Yes. Yay. Okay, I now have four end crystals. Do you wanna come fight the dragon with me? Go. Okay, are you ready? This is gonna be a big fight. Okay, here goes. Okay. This is it. My of power. Okay, stand back, stand back. Quick! Shoot them! Okay, I'm. I got it. That's it! It's gonna die! Oh. Easy. 
We did it! Having obtained the Elytra, my empire was now unstoppable. We then proceeded to refight the Ender Dragon and get Ant and Alex and Elytra. Then I worked on the base, even making a mob farm. Anyway, I gotta go now. Okay, bye. Oh no, I'm in lava, I'm in lava. See that? Somehow, my clumsy self managed to leap into a pool of lava, and now, at risk of losing all my items, I was on two hearts at the bottom of a lava lake. Hi. Okay, go through that portal, go through the portal, go through the portal. Are you sure it's like you've got the negatives and positives right and everything? Let's see. There's like no room for mistakes. Yeah, you're there. Okay. I mean, at least we got another member. Here's a question. Have I just spent a dozen hours gaining control of a Minecraft server? <laughs> Absolutely. Am I going to waste that by leaving everyone alone? Eh? Absolutely not. Hello, you're at the end of the you're at the end of the ball. Uh, I I want five diamonds as tax. I am collecting tax. My However, I think we know how that went. Okay, yeah, you're a lot better. Is he broken? Adds naturally. Oh. Uh -huh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get you. Hang on. <laughs> Oi! <laughs> no, don't you even. <laughs> LB3 Cool Gamer. This is an important name. Instead of paying his taxes, LB killed me four times, so I swore my revenge. He, in turn, created a rebellion to the Citrus Empire called the Uglies. We agreed on a war which would take place in one week. The winner would be crowned the Emperor. I took this time to completely remove the forest at my empire and build a wall. I thought it might help in the war. After all, this war would determine everything. If I lost, then my time on this server would be wasted. So everyone, okay, everyone, Citrus Empire, you're on the, on the ocean side. Oh, okay, there we are, you ready? Oh my gosh, we got the, okay, let's go. Okay, three, two, one, begin. Oh, oh, oh. It's a light drink time. Uh, how dare you? That, that is rude. That is just rude. Stop. Why are you hitting me? Now I have slow falls. Yeah, I know. I have slow falling arrows. That's so good. Whatever you want to do. Whatever you want to do. Oi, 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 oi. Why is my bed there? Oh, my goodness, wait, what? Why did that do so much damage? I got him! <laughs> we killed him! Yes! yes! That must have been the shortest war ever. Using my elytra with my bow, I was able to pop LB's totem, after which I trailed him and performed my coolest trick shot ever, killing him mid-air. However, before celebrating my new role as Emperor, there was one more thing to do. Me. Uh, no, me I want you to do something though. You lost the war. I need you to do one quick thing. Put this on. Oh, oh, okay. I need to. I, I need to have a screenshot of this. I, 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 I caught it. I caught it. I caught it.